For those of us who aren't content with stock clocks or out-of-the-box thermals, there's only really one solution to get the most out of your CPU, and that's water cooling. Now, a lot of hardcore PC enthusiasts will say that proper water cooling setups will cost hundreds of dollars and hours of trial and error. Well, what if I told you that you could achieve excellent thermals and decent overclocking for less than $100? Well, ladies and gents, let me introduce you to the Corsair H60 AIO, the $70 solution to all your water cooling needs. Corsair is known for making a wide variety of PC-related products, ranging from cooling solutions to cases and even RAM. All in all, Corsair offers a wide variety of products, but today we will be focusing on my personal favorites, their AIOs, specifically the Corsair H60. So when you first open up this box, you'll be greeted with a 120mm radiator and accompanying fan. Now the nice thing about the size of this radiator is that it fits almost anywhere inside any mid-tower case or larger. Installing this radiator is actually quite simple and is very similar to installing a case fan. Now along with the radiator and fan, the CPU block and pump are all pre-attached and completely filled with water. There's no need to fill this AIO with any distilled water or any liquids, it's all in a closed system assembly. Installing the CPU block is actually quite simple, but it differs slightly between whether you have an Intel or AMD CPU. Two sets of brackets are included with the H60, allowing you to mount this block on your platform of choice. There's no need to go out and buy separate clips or mountings depending on which CPU you have. They're both included with this AIO. So besides the easy installation process, what does this AIO offer? Well, to start, CPU thermals are way down compared to when I was using the stock fan. My Intel i3-8100 went under a 10 minute stress test, peaked at 45 degrees Celsius, went under the AIO. However, with the puny stock fan, my CPU peaked at 64 degrees. My i3 idles at 34 degrees when using this AIO. However, when I'm using the stock fan, the temperature goes a little bit up and idles at 40 degrees. So there's definitely not that much of a difference when it's on idle, but when it's under stress or being used, there's actually quite a big difference. So along with keeping CPU temperatures down, this AIO also makes overclocking easier and safer. Overclocking for many who are using air cooling solutions is not only a battle for stability, but also a battle for thermals. With an AIO like this, thermals become much less of an issue and you can push your CPU even further. And with a lock chip like this i3 or i5, you can reach turbo boosts more consistently, speeding up your PC a little bit. Now, I'm not currently running an overclockable CPU, but having a good AIO like this one is crucial for an upgrade that I'm planning in the future. Now, a lot of you guys are probably thinking, well, this can't be cheap. Well, like I mentioned earlier in the video, this AIO only costs $70, which is great. Now, if you're looking for something a little bigger, Corsair offers other models, such as the H110i, which has a dual 120mm fan radiator for only about 40 bucks more. So there definitely are options for those with a higher budget, don't get me wrong, but for $70, the Corsair H60 AIO is the most value-conscious liquid cooler for ballin' on a budget. And that is why I would recommend this $70 Corsair AIO. It not only keeps CPU temperatures at bay, but for $70, you're getting an excellent cooling solution for an excellent price. So thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video and want to support the channel, don't forget to leave a like and or subscribe, and don't forget to check out the description if you want to take a look at the Corsair H60. If you want to watch more of this type of content, click here for more videos, and I'll catch you in the next one.